Was this dog taken away? Oh, we gave that dog away. Taz did that. Mm -hmm. That dog was given away. It was, it was two a... dogs. A few... Two. And when that happened, my fence wasn't up. Was not up? It wasn't. And the city told me to put the gate up properly. And I did that. No, ma'am. Did you have homeowner's insurance? Yes, ma'am. And she did file a claim. And when was that? That was the beginning of October of 2015. And was that claim settled? Yes, it was. For how much? $100,000. No, ma'am. It was settled for $51,000. Um, that's probably what shh, she got. Shh, just a second. I don't want you to interrupt her again. Okay. Did you have a lawyer? Yes, ma'am. What was the net amount that your daughter put in the bank? The total amount was 51000 When my daughter got through with the lawyer fees and everything, it was 32000 Yes, ma'am. But you collected that money? Yeah, my daughter collected it in a trust fund for her. Great. Actually, it doesn't make up for these injuries. That's, it doesn't. It, it You're right. It doesn't make up for the injuries. My, my minimum but then... was 100000 It was a $500,000 liability policy. Okay. But they did give her the minimum of 100000 do you still have it? Through State Farm, yes, ma'am. You still have the policy. Okay, and then No, you... no, no. They, they canceled the policy after they paid her off. Did you get another policy? No. You should have another policy. You have how many dogs? Three. What kind of Which is two only living there now. One is a Rhodesian Ridgeback. And the, yes, and, and the other one is like a little German Shepherd. How little a German Shepherd? It's maybe four months, almost four months. So it's a puppy? Yes. You should have insurance. Homeowners. Okay. Get it. Otherwise, she won't have to worry about you. She'll sue you and she'll own your house. Okay. Got it? Yeah. I'm listening. Judge, I just want to say none of this is true what she's saying. My daughter could have been killed. Just listen to me. We're not here to talk about your daughter. Okay. This happened a long time ago. You sued her. Your daughter was compensated for her injuries. And this dog, if I believe you, didn't bite you. You were frightened, you say, by the dog, and you fell. No, I didn't fall. Actually, I was running with my jug in my hand. I threw my one-year-old behind me, and I slipped and twisted my ankle. Threw my door you, behind you, me. Just Her a second. Head. Just a second. Here's the picture. Shh, I'm speaking. OK. So what you're telling me is that you were walking with your water jug. To fill it up again, right. Right. And you fell and no, you slipped. No, I didn't slipped. fall until after I seen her dog come and charging towards my one-year-old. What did you fall on? How did you hurt yourself? I didn't fall. Let's clear that up. I twisted my ankle trying to run and grab my one-year-old and throw her behind me because I was scared that dog was going to tear my little one-year-old to part. And I got the pictures to show it. Show what? Show the injuries of my daughter's head when I had to throw her behind me to protect her. Because, I mean, I don't trust my neighbor dogs, and I don't know what that dog would have did to my baby if I hadn't ran and grabbed her. <laughs>